Hello everyone, I'm Japanese Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in the second episode of us playing as the Yakuza Territories. Last time, we took out good old Vault City, and we're currently in the process of uh, looting its treasures, and giving that, of course, to the good Carson City. The 80s, well, they just died, and we just finished more technology. We have a total of five research slots so far, which might turn into more as time goes on, if we play our cards right. Uh, but right now, after we're done with this focus, we get a little more stability. We get moderate national pride, which is kind of cool. But I do want to... Oh, we still are in debt. Yeah, debt. Ooh. Now we can choose asymmetrical warfares, improvised obstructions, more soft attack, and a little bit more max entrenchment. Uh, yeah, debt. Desert Rangers are having a good time with the Vipers. Ripe World Territory is killing off Pale Folk, which is fine. There they go. Uh, I was going to say, oh yeah, I had someone leave a comment yesterday and told me that the Yakuza Clan Council, you can just choose whichever one you want. Uh, you don't have to, like, stick with one side. You can just choose whichever one. I'm just going to stay with the Yamaguchi just because, honestly, attack and defense on core territory right now is kind of a waste. Kamikaze Wokuo, Woku, daily army XP gain, training speed. Nah, that's not bad, but I was kind of work with my manpower. I don't want to spend too many, too much manpower on my divisions just yet. And Oyagami, less research speed for 10% more monthly population, which would give us, like, maybe one more guy every month. So it's not really worth it. I'm not really going to change it up for right now. Uh, we're doing pretty well anyways. Bushido Hido falls ill. Do we have any upgrades? Bushido, level 3. You're a little sick. Um, we're mostly going to be using infantry. I would love to use robots, but I kind of already made it so that we won't get the max amount of benefits because I didn't go with Automated Workshop or Honor Bound Machines, so... It is what it is. If I would play the Yakuza again, I might go with robots and just wait for a while to get the really strong robots. But for this campaign, not so much. Since we're going to stick with infantry for the most part, Nerd Rage, uh, Gun Nut seems probably like the good idea to do. Lots of infantry attack, lots of infantry defense. Uh, Kazar's Legion is going to war. That's pretty normal. We can sell outdated equipment for a little bit more money. Um, how close are we to finishing these guys off? What do we need? Demo equipment? We already have enough infantry, so let's get a little bit more money. Uh, we can do some of this. Ooh, yeah. Followers of the apocalypse. These people. And we're also manually justifying on these guys. It takes us about 85 more days. Whatever. Uh, yeah, I used drugs yesterday. So outdated equipment. Yeah. Oh, I need more, well, of course I need more caps to do this. Withdrawn. How long does that stay here? Or is it already gone? It might be already gone. We're disrespected, of course, but I think it's already gone, so that should be okay. Unless I'm not seeing something. Current withdrawn, too. Oh, well, maybe we're suffering just a little bit of 2% organization. 23% chance of something catastrophic. That could happen. Well, whatever. Get some motorized flight. It's almost 2276. We got another division. Thank you. Number 9. Take a number 9. Extra large. And a Diet Coke. Cool, you got eight, seven to eight divisions, that's not bad. I really want some uh, close air support. Oh, that can wait a little bit. Right now, we need a little bit more infantry equipment. Definitely more demo equipment, because I want my guys to go a little bit more kaboom. I like the kaboom on guys, so. Ooh, and we've just looted Vault City. We did lose a few factories. Whatever, so be it. So, we can do Mastery of the Blade, which would be okay. Bushido Code is something I really, really want. But new ideas sound kind of, kind of fun, not gonna lie. Uh, the center here, it's okay. This stuff is you know, it's all right. It's not great. But we might want to consider going, expanding a little bit more westward. Reno has always been our greatest rival, and New Reno is extremely close to Carson City. It'll be a simple matter to incorporate New Reno, and thus will be a great target for expansion. We'll do this, so we get that war goal, but then I'll do more, um... Maybe technology stuff? No. Stuff that helps boost our infantry's attack and defense. That's what I want, the Bushido focus. Just because we have nine divisions, new Reno. Well, we do have a non-aggression pact with them. Oh, never mind, we do not have a non-aggression pact with them. They have a few more divisions, they have more manpower. They are going down, actually, let's double check that. Going down the path of the elite, which is <clears throat> calling in old allies. And they're going to go with Sergeant Granite's Defense Company. So I'm going to need a few things that can pierce enemies. Some anti-tanks, some might say. High command, more attack. Sounds pretty good. 5% more attack. Yeah, I'm probably going to go with Brute and Aggressive Attacker at the same time. 
Is there anything else I can do here first? Um, not really that important. How about cultural advisors? Political power, that's not really worth it. Less stability, which I'll use, choose this one, power broker, eventually, but not yet. Let's see, war support's not bad, too. Major businesses, this would be good to do, we'll do that later. I could have two of them. Pre-war designs, whatever. Vehicle companies, whatever. Ships, whatever. Cool, awesome. Give me more attack, it's only 5% more. Eh, 10% loss of defense. You know what, give me more attack. I want a ton of attack. Just attack, attack, attack. Good, and this is almost done. So we can get some anti-tank guns. Oh wait, we already have anti-tank. Oh, duh, I'm, how do, I'm already making that, what am I thinking? I'm not thinking right at all. Now, yeah, words are hard. Uh, I'll put, yeah, yeah. Thousand manpower still mobilizing, that extra 5% comes in handy so much. Smoke signals, I love the smoke signals. Decryption, I can't wait to go to war with these guys. We should do okay against them. We only have nine divisions, but yeah, we should do okay. Do we have an airbase nearby here? No, we don't. We don't have any planes yet, but we're still trying to build up civilian factories because I want at least 15 civilian factories so I can build more stuff. You know what? Just in case, build one there. It shouldn't take extremely long to make. About a month, that's not bad. And then you guys will have, hopefully, close air support by the time we go to war with these guys. She declared war on the Brotherhood of Steel. Man, every time now, at least for a past couple times. So she's very, very aggressive. Incredibly aggressive. Who are you? Yilan. Washington Brotherhood declared war on Port Ma. That's pretty normal. They have followers of the apocalypse rejected. Marrow drinkers, ah, oh, troll warner dead. New Hammond declared war on Murtaugh. Readying for war. Glass production halted. Food for the hungry. Nomadic lifestyle. The revelations of St. Bonobus. Religious schism, religious congregation. Sounds like good stuff. Decode signals all comes in handy against enemies. Actually, I wonder how this is going to change. This, this decryption, encryption stuff will change once the new DLC drops for La Resistance. Now, you might be watching this after La Resistance has dropped, but at the current time, I have no idea. You guys, what's going on here? 9 to 10 divisions were pretty fairly evenly matched. Um, you know what? Let's see what happens. I don't mind going to war immediately. Stability's kind of bad right now. Don't really care. Uh, you all do that. Let's see what happens. Can we win here? Three divisions versus one. Yeah, with that extra 20% attack, that ain't bad. They have no manpower for the most part, too, so. Ah, Western expansion, good. You hold. Improvise obstructions. Improvise tools. Mastery of the blade. Let's find the people in our nation the most skilled with forging blades and, and task them with training a new generation of smiths. In a short time, we will be making better swords than anywhere else in the wasteland. Ah, uh, recovery rate organization. That is muy bueno. And a double thing. So, right now, we can do ancient tactics for decimation, which we hurt our population, but we do get quite a few buffs, including less supply use or wasteland tactics. Ancient or wasteland. I think last time I went with Wasteland just because I really hate that Decimation recruitable population factor goes down by 10% debuff. And Leg Infantry does get more recon on this side. 5% breakthrough, which isn't bad. Oh, 10% for Leg Infantry total. But Ancient Tactics, you get 3% for all infantry motorized. And then 13 for all infantry. More defense, less combat width. Uh, what was the thing I just saw over here that I was very interesting to see combat with? Yeah, that's the same. Oh, recon. Do you guys get recon at all on this side? You don't. So I might need recon companies if I choose this side for decimation. That's right, Japanese people. Choosing ancient Roman tactics in the wasteland. Love it. Mm, bro, doo -doo -doo -doo. And that's a little bit ahead of time. You know I gotta do it now. I've got to get the katanas. I've got to do that. I'd be a fool not to do that. Um, you know what? How about I take Klondex? How close are we to the next... Oh, we're actually fairly close. That's good, that's good. Are we getting paid or... Yeah, we're getting paid soon. If I can spend my political power, war support would be nice, but we're okay. I need stability. Stability in my life. I'll expel the Rift Draft. You know what? Hurt the factories. That's okay. Whatever. We're doing okay here. We've lost 1 versus 29. That's pretty good. The Vipers were annexed. So be it. They have no manpower, which is good. I know we have about a little over a 1,000, but we're going to need that against New Reno. 
Good, 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 good. And go ahead and stop. She was annexed. Yeah, they usually don't ever have a chance to win. That's okay. And then we'll take your next. The other guys recover just a little bit. Really hoping to get this next division out very soon, which will be here incredibly soon. Two, three. There you go. Good. And you can stop. They'll do fine. Ah, another division. Glorious. Thank God. Plop you over there. A Golconda. I'll let them move around a little bit just because I need uh, one more. Di that division move up a little bit. Yeah. Hmm. How am I going to do this? You know what? I'm going to move you over here. Move you over here. Because I want to expand this way to encircle, destroy, cover up. You know, eat up over here. Three, two, good enough for me. Ah, Mastery of the Blade. Very good, very good. And encoded signals. Now, Bushido Code. It's not just making the blade, but teaching one how to use it as well. Let's encourage a culture of discipline among our ranks and train our troops like never before. 50% more attack and defense. Good. Uh, vacuum tubes. It's a little bit too ahead of time. Basic tools. Let's get, let's get some construction stuff like that. Uh, we don't have time for that. We'll do that later. That'll be fine. You guys will do fine. Not really worried. Oh, well, crud. If I move in there, you know what? Let them move in. We're still, we'll still be okay while we encircle another division. It's only one division, but hey, it's still a division. Ooh, that leaves a hole right there. Hmm. You know what? You just focus on there. We can time this well enough that we should be okay. Okay. You know what? You guys come back. You know what? You guys come there. You guys just encircle that way. There you go. Not bad. Yeah. You know, do that. That'd be great. Motorized flight. Uh, immediately attack. And let's get some triplane attackers. It's been a while since I've actually used triplane attackers. Ah, yes. An encirclement already. Always be flexible. Oh, we're getting attacked over here, too. Wither Dogs was annexed. Nice. Good job, Iron Alliance. Come on. Tear these suckers down. Gotta give me some katanas. Good. This should be faltering very soon. And... You know what? Let everyone else take care of it. Ooh, actually. I could go that way. That would get us in circle. Just kind of hang out for now. You know what? If they want to expand this way, so be it. You know what? You hold. You can finish them off by yourself. We've lost 24 versus 229. Now, it's 452. Very good. That being said, you're going to expand this way. We're going to circle these two divisions. Let you march right on in. You guys come here. Ah, Bushido code. Very nice. We can do new recruitment programs for even more population and monthly population, which sounds really good right now. So... By offering incentives to people wanting to serve in our fighting ranks, we can greatly improve the amount of people willing to die on our behalf. Our birth rate improves. Ah, oh, I love the birth rates. Oh. It's like, it's almost as if Japan has problems with their birth rates, no matter what time period. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, we could get encircled here if I'm not careful. Yeah, I'm probably going to get encircled here if I'm not careful. That's okay, take the supply base, that's all I care about. You know what? They're not. They haven't. They're not done moving. Good. Now we have twelve divisions. So good. Kick them out. Kick them dead. Very good. Now, normally I'd probably just click on, like everyone go ahead and destroy the enemies, but you know it's early game. We don't have a ton of manpower, and I want to make sure that we have enough for our neighbors because manpower, it's usually an issue in the campaign. Usually. Go on, you know what? Let them come in. Let them come on in. Oh no, we got encircled. Whatever will we do? We'll just encircle them. Encircle the people who encircled us. Glorious. You guys do that, that, that. You guys, you kind of hang out for now. Ah, political power. What do we do with this? Stability? I like the stability. Research advisor. Ooh, that'd be pretty good to do, yeah. Army XP. I'd like more stability, but yeah, that's pretty good. Mm, you know what? You guys head up there. Take your time. There's no reason to rush. There's absolutely no reason to rush against New Reno. 
no reason whatsoever. Oh, they've actually abandoned the line down here too. Very good, very good. Just you know, head on over there. Take, start taking all the land. They don't need it. Cyclops, they only have one eye. They don't need all this land. You know. Oh, hello. Ah, recruitment programs. New recruitment programs. Why we fight? That's not bad. We get even more stability. Moderate national pride with rising national pride. But, in the meantime, we might want to encourage innovative thought. We cannot resolve on the past forever. Or evolve on the past forever. We need to encourage our people to be innovative. Yes. Yes. Innovation will help us with our future. The survival of our people. Count on us. Oh, look. Paradise Valley. Thank you. Very good. Ah, uh, now it's time for us to make sure that we actually have enough anti-tank guns. I've spent long enough not having enough anti-tank guns, but now we only have six. Hmm. Well, infantry equipment's okay. Demo equipment's okay as well. Tank guns. Do that. Do that. There you go. We'll need some support equipment as well. Give us a little bit more time to produce that stuff. Uh, give us some time to repair this military factory as well. And we are close to having, well, relatively close-ish, to having triplane attackers. Now, we're going to get a little bit of a hit to our population, but that's okay. We will get now wedge formations. Relentless assaults. Love it. Oh, there we go. Hang dogs were annexed. Good. You know what? Throw them on right now. IT tank. That'll be okay. We won't make any more divisions for a while, but that's still okay. Just because I know they have that one power armor division right there. Enclave remnants. I hate that. I don't like that. No, 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 no. NCR declare war on the bandits. Everyone knew that was going to happen. Need some more political power. 1.2 a day. Not bad. Expel the riffraff sounds like fun. I'll probably do basic hygiene. Yeah. 72% isn't bad. Still mobilizing a little bit. Especially since we have modest population growth. Ah, uh, and douse me in your political power. There we go. Next up, expand our new thought. We are seeing a ton of new ideas sprouting among our people, and we need to decide which ideas to focus on, which to, of course, reject. Now, what do we want to do? Chief of Air Force... Oh, man, we got a lot more attack. 20%? Oh, wait, I wanted 5% more. Well, we, we can replace that guy later on, unless it's... Oh, no, he was over here. No. I don't know where he was. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Hmm. Actually, you know what? I want more stability. Uh, this is probably not a good idea. Let's do it anyways. It's probably better actually to do basic hygiene education over everything else. Oh, well. Timekeepers were annexed. Very good. Glory Falls. Like, how many divisions do they have? I have 11. They're 13 to 17. How many anti... Oh, we need a lot of anti-tank. Holy cow. Yeah, I'm gonna... Ooh, I could wait. I could wait. How much anti-tank are we making? Five a week? That's not enough. There you go. There you go. I want at least one a day. Give it about three more seconds, and then I'll go to war with these guys. At least to take love lock. Division per division, besides their power armor, we should be able to hold it off okay-ish. Um, actually, do we have any planes? Oh, we got... Yeah, actually, hold on. Before we do that... How many planes we got? Three? Could be worse. Could be better. Three. Two... Good enough, I don't care. Go ahead. Oh, we just researched something, too. Nice. You three should be able to, should be able to be okay. Uh, followed up with seed selection or plant cultivation, I suppose. Good. Yeah, you guys... Yeah. Looking pretty good. For the most part, I just want us to hold. Just because I know they have more divisions than what they appear to have right now. You could probably win there. You could... Yeah... Yeah, that'd be good. You know what? If you say that you can do well in attack, you know what? I'm just going to trust you. You know what? Just give you a force attack. Screw it. Give me as much attack. And we've got katanas. I should have waited for the katanas. Oh. Oh. I'm going to need some recon, too, on these bad boys. If you know me, I love the recon. Pipe guns. Yes. Yes. Oh, what else do we need? Oh, that's pretty good. Industry stuff, vacuum tubes, why not? Let's be on the cutting edge of technology. Haha, <laughs> cutting edge. Expand on new thought. I love the political power. Now, I really want that extra research slot. Because, yeah, I get more construction speed, production efficiency cap. Whatever. 
you know, eventually you'll have enough civilian factories, it doesn't even matter. So, focus on ingenuity. We need to encourage wild, crazy ideas. Far different than those of the past. Let's see what this generation can come up with. Ah, yes. Let us see. Focus on the internal sphere. You know what? Basic hygiene. I want as much stability as fast as possible. And here, do we? We don't need any more resources either. I've noticed that so far in this campaign, I haven't really focused too much on building like civilian factories in most of my campaign, just because it's not that feasible to in the beginning. So, hmm. You know what? Actually, let's keep an eye on this. So we'll do this. We'll do that. We want to get to consolidate our holdings. Next in Vault City. Let's see. Yeah. Then we can do that. And then we can deal with the Rangers if we want to defend against them. Trade with the NCR. Fight the NCR. Build a wall. Further expansion against the Antelopes, which we'll do, and the Northern Plains against Pale Folk and the Cyclops tribe, which we already killed. Ripe World Territory. Huh. Antelopes are next. Don't think I'm not looking all beautiful at you for a reason, son. Good. How are you winning so well? Oh, good. Brotherhood, old country. I need to play them sometime. I heard they have their own sub mod. Sounds like fun. Sounds like a lot of fun. I gotta remember, we actually have enough demo equipment for me to put on them as a support company. Ooh, hello. Just walk on in and have a good time with them. Losses 20 versus 233. Not bad. Great Khans join the Northern Mojave Pact. Interesting. You guys can probably help out. It's fine with me. Fine with me. No, we need re new Reno. We could really use new Reno. One, 1v1. One How about 2v1? Grinding out a little bit more army XP is muy bueno. Oh, actually. Yeah, we're still doing okay here. Three planes out of three. Go up to 50 if you can, which will never happen. That's okay. Nice. Yeah, don't let him in. If I just take new Reno, will we win? We should be able to. We should be able to. Basic tools. Good, good, good. Metalworking. Uh, engineering. Land doctrine. Specialized doctrine. You know what? Let's start doing a little bit of that, just because we can. Our research for ship stuff is obviously very bad, but that's okay. Uh, and new ideas. Our people, due to our encouragement, are coming up with countless new, innovative ideas. Yes, yes. Good. Win. Losses. Fall of New Reno, 36 versus some hundreds. Easy. Ah, uh, the Enclave, they had their chance. They had their potential chance to come back, at least in New Reno. But I said, nah, not today, man. It's ja Japanese time. Let's see. So this is our field marshal. So doing this stuff, eh, not really worth it. Just because... Oh, recon. I like that. Ooh. Commanding officer traits, though. Flexible. Negotiator. Cult of personality. Those aren't bad. Division recovery rate. Because we already have a bonus to this. It might be better to get even more. Uh, ferocious loyalty. Out of supply. Defense isn't bad. Attack. Melee hacker. Fight the power. Uh, that's not really worth it. You know what? Give me... I want... A ton of recovery rate. Just because I never choose stuff like that. We have... He is a smooth talker. Smooth talker. Cool. Gliders, you did great. I am Oh, well, you're all dead. But uh, I might consider making a few fighters, you know, n close to the end game when we don't have much of that. Uh, no, don't even make them. You know what? You have one? Nah. You don't even... Uh, nah, nah, nah. Nah. You know what? You know what? No. Nah, nah, nah. Thanks. Thanks for playing, guys. I appreciate it. But nah. We, we good. Uh, let's build this up, up again. Good. Muy bueno. Uh, radar, that'd be nice to have. What am I thinking? I'm thinking of something right now. Money. Do we got enough stuff we can sell? Uh, I think so. Great. Wedge formations. Mm, more breakthrough, more soft attack. How about we get more soft attack and more hard attack? Ah, uh, not bad. Pretty good so far. Now, in the long run, if the very, very long run, if I continue to make it like this a wasteland conquest, which it probably won't. I won't conquer the entire wasteland just because I did that recently at the time of this recording with the Myrlorks. Not interested in doing that, so... We'll see how far we get, though. We'll see how far we get. More stability, though? Eh, we're doing okay on that. Oh, actually, you know what? Tell them to help us with settlements. I love the civilian factories you get from the, from it. Not much, it's only one. But it does help with more recruitable population. And you know what? How about a sixth research slot? But we could go further left, but the right side is where we need to be. This stuff, I'm not interested. We could build our industry up. Not interested. Reallocate. Relocate. 
Ooh, New Reno's Arms Industry, Sierra Army Depot. That's this one. So, New Reno has always had a vastly superior arms industry to us. By moving some of New Reno's resources, though, and gangs to Carson, we can centralize our assets, of course. Eh, it's a casual sixth research slot. Just casual. Uh, give me more efficiency cap. Because why not? I definitely need more divisions down here, though. And we definitely need more anti-tank. But we're working pretty well now. Roughly three a day. That's pretty good. How are we already 25 minutes into this video? It always surprises me. Just how fast these videos go when you're having a great time. Ugh. Uh, infrastructure, you can come down a little bit more. White likes clip. Now, I don't like that because I need their territory. Hmm. That's going to be a big no-no to me. Can I? Uh, they're fighting the Tarwalkers and Ripe World. If the Ripe World territory is smart enough, they can defend their territory in this little area, like 300, you know. They can't really use their numbers over here too efficiently. Uh, if, unless they're attacking. Just because I do, I'm pretty sure I need, you know, Bayo Wave, Battle Mountain, stuff like that. I'm pretty sure I need that. Uh, we could do that. We can wait on that a little bit, though. That stuff, that stuff. Industry stuff. Let's double check. So, because consolidate our holdings. So we need these two, so we get that done. Further expansion. Well, maybe we'll be okay. You know what? Maybe we'll be okay without it. I'm probably going to have to kill off the white legs, though. We should be okay. For a little bit. Siege Raider Arms, Ruthless Drills, never really interested in that stuff. Not interested in any more drugs, too. Are we still withdrawn? Kurth with current withdrawal is 2%. I doubt it's a p uh, planning speed, outside volunteers, experienced soldiers lost. 11 divisions, all I have is 11 divisions, it's not a lot. Division attrition, hmm, no, it doesn't look like it. Yamaguchi, yes, I know I have 100 political power I could spend it on, but I don't know. Followers influence. No mutants allowed. No training time goes down. Raiders of the sky, that's okay. Raiders of the sea, that's still okay. You know what? Resources, output. I just want stability. That's all I care about. <laughs> uh, another division, great. Join the clan. Oh, uh, group. Oh, we need another division over here. How many divisions do these guys have? Oh, it's only 12 more days. Nice. Revered. Oh, does. Militarized society. Eh, that's okay. Oh, you know what? We have it. It's hard sometimes to get more weekly war support. It hurts our organization, but whatever. And another division. Oh, a little bit of lag. Oh, oh, oh they flooded in. They flooded in. How big are you guys? Oh, 37 divisions, that's, that's more than us. But let's go ahead and do Sierra Army Depot. The Sierra Army Depot, while it lacked, or was, while it was looted by a merc owning loyalty to the Wright family a few years back, still holds untold riches. We should investigate these lucrative old ruins. Now, when I go to war with the White Legs, as long as I don't go to war with anyone else, all we need is a front line here, and we should be able to hold. Probably bait the enemy to attacking us quite a bit. Let's go ahead and go to war once this division moves. You know, I'm not even going to wait. Just go ahead. You should be able to do okay-ish. I mean, yeah, maybe you might not win here immediately. That's okay with me. Ah, vacuum tubes. Very good, very good. Primitive radio. Awesome. And honestly, you should just be able to walk into there. Antelope reservations. You. Where the hell are you going? Go to Modoc, please. Denio. Pro weapons production. Focus on the internal sphere. Meh. Meh. That's alright. Thank you for replying. Thank you for being engaged with my soldiers. And I can't click on the We Are at War button. Dang it. I want to see how many losses I've taken. But they should capitulate, like, right now, probably? Would that be possible for them? I don't know. Just take their territory. There's nothing up here. I'm kind of surprised they're still alive. I'm not going to lie. Good, good, good. Yeah, get to Denio. That should be it. Oh, good. We're still winning for the most part, I think. Getting a lot of experience. That's nice. Come on. You know what? Can you help out that way? You might be able to. 
Unobstructive piloting. Air base raids. Oh, you know what? You know what? That's right. We don't have much, but it will suffice. Uh, eventually go up to 50. I'm not worried about that so far. That'll be good. And, oh, we got encircled. But not for long. And... Boom. Save the division. There you go. Easy. Wasn't really too worried about that. Now, rifle territory is going to be kind of a concern. The Desert Rangers are going to be concerned. And holy cow, Arroyo! Oh, you're so big. You're such a big boy. Brotherhood of Steel, Brotherhood of Steel, Northern Mojave Pact. Either Kemalt Station. I think. You know what? How about the Shoshone? Finalized defenses? Yeah, well, you know what? Why not? Why not? They, they look like a, a bunch of great people over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then maybe the Kemalt Station because. Not, not bad. Looking pretty good. Looking pretty impressive, I'd say. Ooh, still updated equipment? Sure. So get. Ah! Oh, we're out of debt! It took us this entire episode so far to get out of debt. Now we can feel better about ourselves. We can begin a scavenging program. Let's repair all this stuff, because that's fairly important to do. Ah, uh, now my foot's asleep. Hmm. Come on, foot. Very nice, very nice. And what are we doing right now? Oh, Sierra Army Depot. Good, because we could use a little bit more population. We have less than a thousand, which isn't great. But soon enough, we're going to consolidate our holdings, which costs actually a lot of time to do. Oh, happy 2277, though, my friends. Happy 2277. All we need more is more close air support for now. Because everything else is looking pretty darn nice. You know what? You do that. That's important to do. We got plenty of anti-tank for now. Do that. That's good. Do that. That'll be good. Uh, there you go. We need more grenades. Good. Automation. I love automation. Uh, resources. We're doing pretty well. Crop rotation. Six research slots. Could be so much worse. Mm. Ying Tao declare war on Yampa, that's okay. Kaiser's agent declare war on cowboy countries. Follower aid, you know what, let's do that so we can get start doing some of that stuff. Kane formations, awesome. How about we get some cult of personality, which is okay. Special forces capacity multiplier, eh, that's alright. And we do get a little bit of daily army XP. The thing though, we gotta keep an eye on is that we have enough divisions, because in time... We're going to need a lot. Let's consolidate our holdings. Our old supply routes won't, won't do with our holdings now ex extending so far afield. Or how about I'll put it like this. Our supply routes aren't conductive to our current military. So, you know what? Let's reroute our supply chains, adjust our patrols, and change our administration as necessary to account for our new holdings. And we get some stability out of it. That's pretty nice. Right now we get 56 bottle caps per quarter, which is very good. Samurais, in time, I do want to switch this out with even more demo people. Ooh, combat width. But we want to maybe wait on that. Metal working, very good. Oh, I did want to throw on some demo here. Yeah. That, that's nice. That's good stuff. I love the explosives. And we want some chem companies. Chem, 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 chems. You know what? Do that immediately anyways. That'll be okay. Alright. And I will end the episode soon. I just want to make sure we just go a little bit longer. Let's see. Training time. Wasteland. Um, you know what? Just if our time goes down. That's that's pretty good for us. Yeah. I can't wait to get more manpower. That'd be great. How much longer do we have with this? New Hammond doing a pretty not bad job. Pretty not bad. They did get encircled quite a bit. Hmm. Uh, doesn't look good for them. You guys. It's a little bit ahead of time. Don't want to do that. Support companies. Recon. Uh, this is definitely a t ahead of time. You know, do more recon. Even though we don't have it on yet, I still want to put it on there eventually. Followers of the Apocalypse. Looking pretty good. We get about 22 people a month. We're doing well on that. How many divisions do these guys have? Because we have anti-tank. We put on some demo companies. Actually, does anyone green? No, they're not green. Bushido is looking pretty good. You guys, Takamori. He's, he might be learning stuff. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Uh, influence. Yamaguchi's doing perfect. Oh, look at that war support. That's so nice. That's stability. So nice. Infantry equipment. Not bad. Come on. More research speed. Primitive radio. Not bad, not bad. Resources? Yeah, we could maybe do that a little bit. Wait, we're importing separate 
Huh, I didn't know I was importing stuff from Kazar's Legion. I guess that's scrap I really needed early on. Man, our factories, they could definitely be doing better. Good, good, good. Finish this up, finish this up. Come on. Lots of attack, lots of defense. And explosive boys. Love it. There you go. And for now, I'm going to throw you right there. Should be okay-ish to do that. Come on, give me something else. Well, there's one more thing before we end this camp, this episode. 55, that's good. How strong are their divisions, actually? Five infantry battalions, six motorized battalions, their special forces. Have five and a fire team. Looks pretty normal. Looks, yeah, looks pretty normal. That's why you make your divisions 20 combat width. Come on, 64. Give me one more thing, one more thing. Airbase raids. Sounds good. How are our planes? 11's not bad. You guys come up there for now. North Nevada, you just hold for now. I could train him, but I don't want to lose any planes due to accidents. I really don't want any accidents. That wouldn't be good. Oh, we made must have made another division. Um, we should be okay. We're about to get more manpower, airbase raids, even more ground attack. But that, my friends, is all the time for that we have today. We have crop rotations. Uh, but so tomorrow, we shall go to war with the Shoshone Nation. We shall continue doing our focuses and expanding and growing ever larger. And to the point where we might get attacked in a two-front war, because that's what's just probably going to happen. But anyways, like I said, guys, if you enjoyed this episode, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you all tomorrow when we try to take Dickens from the Shoshone Nation. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.